Hey, 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 what's up champions? Gedeminas here. Hope you guys are doing fantastically well. Welcome to Financial Freedom TV. And today I wanted to talk about being stupid. Now I know not a single one of you stupid who's watching this video, but just in case, I thought I'll give you this advice anyway. So if you're watching a replay of this video, please do me a massive favor and stick hashtag replay into the comments. If you're brand new, if you're watching one of my videos for the first time, please do say new in the comments as well. And of course, if you do get some value, if you learn something from this video, feel free to share it. Maybe somebody else will get some value too. So the title of this video is, if you're gonna be stupid, you better be tough. <laughs> what do I mean by that? I mean that there's a, always a group of people who refuse to invest in themselves. Like somebody said, you know, some people would not participate in their own rescue. Hey, Gabia, thanks for joining. Right? So uh, I remember, I think, who was it? I think it was uh, uh, Tim Sales who said, if you think education is expensive, you should see how expensive stupidity is. <laughs> hey, Emma, thanks for joining, right? So investing in yourself, educating yourself is the best and the most clever thing you can do for your life or your business, for your uh, advancement, etc. But some people choose not to invest in themselves. They choose not to read uh, books. They choose not to watch, uh, you know, programs. Hey, Karen, thanks for jumping on. Uh, they choose not to attend seminars or webinars, etc. They basically choose not to learn, which I'm not saying if you're not doing personal development, you're going to be stupid or you are stupid. I'm not saying that, actually. But what I'm saying is, by investing in yourself, by, by learning more, by get, becoming wiser and more clever, you make your own life easier. Because you avoid doing mistakes, because if you learn from other successful people, you can learn what things work and what things don't work. And if you learn what things don't work, then you can avoid doing those things. But if you don't know what doesn't work, then you're gonna to have to do all of those mistakes by yourself. And somebody said that you have to learn from other people's mistakes because your life is too short to do all of those mistakes by yourself. So if you understand that, then the more you can learn, the quicker you can progress. The more years you can shave off your journey, because you're going to get there so much faster, because you're going to avoid strategies that don't work, you're going to avoid making mistakes, you're only going to do the things that people who already have results teaches you how to do, you're going to have an easier life, right? But if you choose not to, if you choose not to invest, then you have to be tough. You have to be tough as nails. You have to be so strong because you're going to experience failure after failure after failure, disappointment after disappointment, you know, uh, pain after pain after pain. There's only two ways. You either educate yourself and you go the easy route, or you don't educate yourself and you go the hard route. There's no other option. You can't choose the middle, right? So it is up to you to choose, but I advise you not to be the second route person, not to go the hard way. Instead, find people who already have the results you wanna get. Find people who are already doing the things that you wanna do, and then model them learn from them, read their books, watch their videos, attend their seminars, etc. So you can learn what they did to achieve success and then you can model that to create success on your own. So that's my tip for today, my friends. Hope you found it useful. If you did, feel free to share it. Have a great rest of your day and I'll see you at the top. Bye for now.